Don't set depreciations on great results you've seen for the past few years. Set them realistically for what we're likely to see in 2016 and 2017. What we do is we try to talk to the client about their, their depreciation. You know, uh, one of the things we've been telling them for the last couple of years is don't set their depreciations on the great results they've had for, for the past few years. You know, be realistic and, and set it for what it's going to be you know, now in 2016, 2017, where it's going to be a more normal market than we've had in the past. So we don't want to find them in the trap where they've been seeing all these great gains on depreciation uh, and they depreciate based on that and it's surprised in the future.